over a St. Patrick's Day, a mighty man, Ned Kelly, a mighty man fought against the powers and principalities of secular humanistic postmodernism. He saw in the poor the injustices of the rich. He laid his life down for those that were to bring that spirit of courage and freedom to Australia, a man that would buck the principles of capitalism, that would, in the cross of the Eureka, remember the suffering of Jesus and those faces of those that monopolize and intimidate and, and corrupt the world that we live in with their seven liberal arts, rhetoric, logic and grammar, dialogue, the believable lies they tell, the media that they use to tell the lies, that false news. Arithmetic, sacred geometry, music and astronomy that are used today to dim the minds and make those that would almost indefinitely be saved to be damned. Just as Ned was damned in his time. We love Ned, but we especially love Jesus. He is the creator and the redeemer of light that we're called to shine into the darkness daily and storm the gates of hell on a daily basis with truth and life and light. Our lives are in your